But here today, here in 2022, in this it city, our home, there are those who are the enemies of our hopes and visions for this city. Yes, haters gonna hate. Our enemies don't want to ambush and kill us. Oh God, I hope not. But, but they want to kill our dreams. And like Nehemiah and his crew, as a justice organization, there are some abuses that we need to correct in this it city. Abuses like unfair wages. Abuses like our black and brown children being undereducated and oversuspended. Abuses like having too many of our citizens spending an unfair and unjust amount of time in jail because they have no way to make their bail. Abuses like Nashville not being committed enough to providing enough affordable housing for all its citizens. Abuses of too many of our senior citizens minding their own business, living peaceably in their own house, in their own neighborhood for 40 years or so until some fat cat high roller from California moves in and disturbs their peace by building a hotel-sized mansion right next door to their house that jacks up their property taxes. I'm talking about abuses, y'all. And our leaders just can't stand there and let these abuses happen. So, like Nehemiah and his boys, we may sometimes need to have a tool in one hand and a weapon in the other. I'm not talking about that kind of weapon. But the tool that I'm talking about would be the hammer of justice. If I had a hammer of justice, and our weapon must always be the spirit of truth and righteousness, I know I got a witness in this place.